Hi guys, we're back with another video and this will be our last mukbang. So let me eat a little bit and get into it and um, then we'll explain later. So let's get started because I'm starving. I'm going to pass you this okay. because it is late here and I just thought so much of you guys. Like, I love my subscribers, all of you, the ones in the mukbang community, the ones in no community, like, whatever you have going on, I love you guys, so, I absolutely wanted to take the time to talk to you guys tonight, here are my passes to you, Oops. okay, my bad, I don't eat that though, <laughs> a girl is hungry, mm. I'm gonna start with these. That big old, I did some grilled chicken legs and some king crab and I'm gonna go ahead and get this party started because honey, your girl is starving. I'm gonna give me a leg and everything. I don't even care about nothing. Look at that. It's huge. This is the second time we've tried these. So this is you want a bigger chicken? I'll start with this. Okay. One. This is the second time we've, you know, really, really liked tried these legs and I'm gonna tell you first time I was turned off because I ain't no punk. Russian crab legs are terrible. Yeah. So we have here a seafood sauce. Let me show you guys. It's freaking hot. Mm -hmm. oh, I can't really show you but you can see through the ball. That's why we use last. So these are so good. This is my own seafood sauce. I didn't follow nobody's directions. Tell me what you think about it Mark when you taste it. The sauce? Yeah. Put your chicken in it, but don't tell me. <laughs> don't don't try to make me feel better. I can accept it. <laughs> oh, let me get some salad. Oh, I'm so hungry. Oh, let me let me pray about this mm. though, y'all. Hold on. Mm. Hey, Amen. Because I'm hungry. Mm -hmm. mm. Mm. The sauce is good. Don't worry, I pray for you. I pray. You wash your hands. Let's try this. All right. Mm. Mm -mm 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 -mm. I'm hungry. I'm tripping on this though. Mm-hmm. I don't want so we use this rub. And it's not what I thought it would be. But that's cool because my because my sauce is everything though. <laughs> I got a cinnamon stick in there. Yeah, I know I can taste it. Mm-hmm. Cause the ground cinnamon just ain't had nothing on it. Mm -hmm. Listen, I started I got these cinnamon sticks from the Indian um bizarre and it's so good mm -hmm. that's bomb that is mm -hmm. we married so y'all we can we use the same bowl i don't generally do this with him but since this is scorching hot now hopefully i can't kill anything but his germs what you drinking i'm drinking a coke zero I am drinking spiced rum with lemonade tea with Dr. Pepper, y'all. But I got a Gatorade over here for when this run out because I, I can't drink no more. Let me bust out one of these. One of these. That chicken's bomb, though. I know. All right, look. Oh, wow. Oh, yeah, broke. Dang on it. <laughs> okay, so I'm gonna rub this stuff off. I guess that's the fat. I don't like the way that looks, so. We probably should get some scissors. I'll get them. Hold on. Mm hmm. Yeah, I'm gonna get them scissors, though. Uh. Ooh, that's hot. Mm. Woo! <laughs> Woo! Mm. Ain't nobody stole no scissors. We use this I would have got them to start with. Okay, so so let me tell you why I am why I am leaving the mukbang community because if you don't get me wrong, y'all are so much fun. <laughs> I love food, but chicken's good, ain't it? Mm -hmm. Um, I ain't missing no no seafood at all. Like I'm gonna need it all. Um, this tastes totally different from the Russian. Well, yeah. Yes. Them Russian ones was dirty tasting. I was scared. I didn't want no more. 
I'm not, no, <laughs> listen, no puns, <laughs> for real intended. I just, they taste the Russian legs from Sam's, taste totally different. So, let me tell y'all, if you look at my channel, and you see my videos and stuff, y'all see most of my videos are cooking videos. And I really am a cooking channel. But I began to use mukbanging as a filler because, listen, when you making these recipes five and six days a week, I be tired. It's hard. He works and he has to come home and do it. So we tired. So we do. Mm, mm, the sauce is bomb. So we do use. We need more pepper chat. Yeah. So we do use mukbangs as a filler. But I don't want this to be the, the core of my channel because that's not what I'm about. That would be my dogs. Yes, truly. Thanks, babe. So I just wanna I just wanna say that I love all my subscribers. I love you guys, no matter what community you're in, whether it be mukbanging, mukbanging, um, Shay. She is, she dresses for BBWs or plus sizes. She's beautiful. She's great. I love the real birdie. I love Simply K. She's probably, Simply K is probably one of my favorites along with, um, oh my gosh. You want to squeeze your lemon on it? Like, Regardless, I have so many of my favorites. And I love you guys. Listen, Annabelle and Nicole Marie and Kiana. I love y'all. Like, y'all inspire me to cook recipes that you can use on your channel. Unfortunately, I've said this on other on other channels, and I'm gonna say or uh, other other uh, TV or video. Lord Jesus, I've said this on <laughs> other videos before, but I'm gonna say this again. I am a severe diabetic. I am just now getting my diabetes under control. Everything that I bake, cook, or make, we do not eat it. I do pass it along. Nothing along, goes, nothing goes to waste. Nothing goes to waste. We just don't eat it. Mm -hmm. We got a big family. We got a lot of friends. Yeah. So another thing with that also is, along with me being diabetic, I do, I am a, I have chronic kidney disease. My functioning right now is not at its worst, but it's not at its best. And we kind of want to keep it there. Um, and when I have gout flare-ups, it feeds to, I know that's right, baby. Put your chicken leg in there. That chicken leg is so sexy. <laughs> But, um, it kind of, when I eat red meat and stuff like that, like, I don't, it feeds to my situation. So, on top of that, I am, I did have a gastric R and Y. So, I need this to work for me. There's no room for me to fail. Because I'm already dying. And I'm just trying to prolong the time that I do have. And I could do healthy mukbangs, but I can't, you know, I can't, I can't eat five days a week like that. I can't, you know, meal after meal after meal. And I have to be able to not only live and sustain, but I have to have two adult children, a boy and a girl, or a man and a woman, should I say. 17 and 19, about to be 18 and 20. I have nieces and nephews that love the auntie male. I have a husband that I love. So I really need to do what I set out to do. And that's to cook for you and to give you what you want. And I'm hoping that a lot of my subscribers will stay that are in the mukbang communities so that you take my recipes further. You try it and you tweak it and you do what you want to do and you fix it how you like it. And tag me and tell me what I can do better for you or what I can. I take requests. I'll do anything for you guys, you know. So I just wanted to tell you that this will be my last mukbang. 
I will always taste my food. I just feel like with what's going on right now with my health and I need to be more cautious and um, eating isn't for everybody and it mm -hmm. most certainly is not for my specific health requirements. Um, too much eating, too much grease, too much fat, too much of anything can set set my kidneys off. And because I'm going to tell you, before my gastric bypass surgery, my kidney function was in the 30s. I mean, like we were literally, we were getting prepared to, to for dialysis. So I just want to show gratitude for being alive right now. And I want to show gratitude Listen, for our, heaven, for our Heavenly Father for giving me the opportunity to stay alive or our Creator or whoever it is. And I just want to honor that. That's all. But it doesn't stop me from making my videos. It doesn't stop me from making you guys happy. So whatever it is that you want me to do, whatever it is that you want me to fix, I will do whatever I have to do to, to keep you guys happy and my husband. So is there anything you want to say? Not really? Okay. <laughs> Okay, let me finish eating too. I just wanted you guys to know why I said this would be my last mukbang. Because I I don't want I want to live. <laughs> I, and I'm not saying everybody that's dying. I, you know, everybody that eats or that's overweight, are, they're not unhealthy. But what I am saying is that I am. And I can't, I can't afford it. I'm scared. It's hard Such an ordeal it's, it's that hard, I've been through. It's hard for us to do the mukbangs like the others mm -hmm. because we can't eat like that. I just can't. Since the surgery she had, it's her her intake is not like it used to be. And too much meat, and she can't have a lot of a lot of red meats. A lot of meat, period. A lot of meat, period. Because of my gout, maybe because of kidney distress. Because of anything, too much protein, like, most people who've had the gastric bypass are supposed to be on protein drinks and stuff. Not me. I got protein spilling out of my urine mm -hmm. because my kidneys can't process it. And the lightest form of protein for me is chicken fish. And among many other things, um, also with vegetables, that's the best protein for me really is vegan protein. But I'm a meat eater, y'all. I recognize that. But, um, I just don't want you guys to think that I don't love the community for everybody, for all that they've done and everything, you know, that you guys have been in the community, you know, and whew, and, that and it doesn't mean that you want a big one or a small one. Um, you know, that's a heavy one. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Here, because you be playing with food. Mm -hmm. you eat it doesn't mean that you're going to unfollow them. Absolutely not. We would love to see, the, for the ones that do cook their own meals, we'd love to see you guys take some of her recipes, tweak it what you need to, and make a mukbang out of it. And we want to see yours. So that we can possibly, you know... Say, hey, we got this recipe from whoever, Simply K and Kiyama and anybody who's out there doing, what's the meat in this? Look at my emotions. <laughs> <laughs> you know, Soulful out. Tea and her sisters on the journey. We all on a journey somewhere. So I just want to, you know, I just, I don't want to just stop doing my things and you guys are like, where's she at? Right. I want you guys to understand why I can't do them. There ain't no meat in there. Lies. I probably already pulled it off. I did. I'll put that piece. No, I'm not going to let that piece go on smoking. Anyway, you know, I don't want you guys to be like, oh my God, where'd she go? You know, she's not really, she's not doing anything. We didn't, we didn't really start really. the channel for that, though. No, but we we started the channel for the cooking and the but baking. We, but we began to use but these we, filler movies when right. we got tired because let me tell y'all something. It's one thing to eat, <laughs> but it's a whole another bar game when you got to to edit film and you got to make this stuff and you baking. Like sometimes it takes me. Oh my god! And you know he gets off work at five in the evening. So, 
Sometimes so, later. Yeah, and let me and, tell y'all, um, when you're doing videos, when you're doing videos for three and four, sometimes our videos, you get off work, he don't get barely to take a shower right away or nothing. It's like immediately he has to start filming with me. And he does such a good job. And we're we're a pair, so that's I'm not gonna do it without him. But I, I promise you, like he we be up till 11, 12 o'clock at night. And sometimes Sundays. that's when we're starting to eat our dinner. Yeah, for real. Yeah. Like well, tonight it's already almost ten o'clock. He has to work in the morning. The, la the last thing I want to do is come home from, mm -hmm. from work at 5, 6 o'clock. Right. And have to wait three, three or four more hours before I can eat dinner. Right. So it's very hard for us. So we find that a lot of our videos are taking over the weekends. Like we cram them in. Like we had two days to cram in five videos. Mm -hmm. And it's difficult. It's hard. But we do it for you. Mm-hmm. Because that, you know, and we enjoy it. I, I don't do. know about you. I like. I love it. I like seeing you cook. It's a passion that you have. I'm not gonna stop doing try hauls. Don't get me wrong. I'm not gonna stop doing gadget hauls. I'm not gonna stop cooking. We have to be careful because of my health, y'all. I have to be very. I have to tiptoe around my health. Mm -hmm. I'm not like everybody else. I can't do what everybody else does, and I have to recognize that I can't have a lot of sugar. I can't have a lot of protein. I can only have certain vegetables and so much of them. It's hard. And it's really hard to, to it's, pick. And it's scary. It's, it's, it, it's hard to pick good, healthy choices of food. It is. To do a mukbang on. And you constantly. Well, Simply K does good. She's a pescatarian. Okay. So she does a lot of, of you know, um, she does a lot of... Ooh, uh, fish, which uh, fish is probably going to be one of my, I'm getting all this out. Fish is probably going to be one of my lighter choices. Fish and chicken, whether it be thigh or breast. I can't really eat breast. I haven't been able to eat breast since my gastric bypass. So that is why we eat so much dark meat um, because it, it's more juicy and it's more fattier and it goes down easier. Um... But I can I do I can put a salad away, y'all. Like mounds of vegetables and fruit and stuff. But even fruit, I have to be careful of fruit because um <laughs> I have to be careful of fruit because um well you know. I need your scissors. Okay, hold on, babe. Let me get this juice on here. Out. <laughs> here. I have to be careful of even fruit because of the sugar intake. Uh, you know. Just eating fruit can be hard on my kidneys. It can be hard on my diabetes. Um, do it hot. We'll go out and make a mess of Jesus. Mmm. That's what we're in it for right there. A mm -hmm. chunk of meat. Mmm-hmm. Did you get that out of the jungle? Mm -hmm. No. That came off the arm. Or whatever you want to call it. All right, baby. All right, baby. Mm -hmm. So that's all. So I hope everybody had a great weekend. And because we did, we try to make the most of it, even when this can be crappy at times. You want another chicken? Okay. <laughs> Look, I ain't even eating my salad. I'm That's so this. good. Let me tell y'all. This big old bowl. I don't know what world everybody living in with four sticks of butter. I don't know how much sauce you're making, mm, but this bowl right here, I did three, a quarter, what is it, uh, three quarters of a stick of butter on this. I used a little bit of olive oil, and let me tell you the secret to any sauce. Where we at, how many minutes, 20? Okay. Let me tell you the secret to any sauce. That cinnamon stick. Spices. Oops. Oh, Jesus. <laughs> Spices. Because. Keep passing the scissors. 
spices, it's one thing to use butter and garlic, and but when you get to getting into the spices, it changes the game. Now, I got a cinnamon stick, cloves, star anise. Now, I can't tell you what to put in yours because I'm the type of person that just kind of throw it together in mine. But, what I will say, what I will say is, um, any spice that you think is only good for baking sweets, you're wrong. You have to mix the sweet savory with the sweets. And listen, this is spice and star anise and cloves and allspice. And ginger paste and garlic, oil. And I just, listen, I ain't gonna lie, I opened my refrigerator and was like, what can I put in this today, y'all? <laughs> And I was like, it don't even matter as long as it tastes good. You do that with a lot of your recipes. I do. I don't really have a um, a set way to, to do stuff. But right now, I'm really glad that I'm filming them because um, we are also talking about taking our page, our YouTube, to the to the the, the internet for real, like building a web page, and also seeing what it would take to publish a couple cookbooks because, and not just for. For one type of eater, but for all kinds of eaters. Look at that, baby. Look at that. This tastes totally different from that other stuff. Them Russian crab legs, though. Them, them and I made me feel good inside. I was, we couldn't even eat them, remember? Yeah. The water is so different. And a Russian crab leg than it is. Oh, that's fat. Like, I'm not gonna eat that unless you like that stuff right there. You see it? Mm -hmm. But the, the, um, there's something about the cold water crab that. Russian's very cold. Russia's very cold. That's cold water too. That water just ain't right, y'all. Well, mm -hmm. it's oh, a it's different a dried tomatoes. Cold water. I'm sorry. Babe. It's, uh, Mmm, how do you like this? They did not taste like this. Mm -hmm. These are bomb. I was even scared. I put some sun dried tomatoes in this too, some brown sugar. I was scared to, um. Mmm. I was scared to try these. Because I know they're going to taste like it. I was like, what if Well, you, you, you don't really, if you've never had an Alaskan crab. No. Versus what we had. Who does hide? Woo. As far as the mm -hmm. Russian. Mm -hmm. One napkin? Yeah. Yeah. Thank you. Welcome. Them Russians are terrible. No pun intended. <laughs> <laughs> but uh, I'm telling you, like, I couldn't even eat them. We couldn't eat them, remember? We was like, eh, we are done. Well, it, it's kind of like when we went to to Florida that time. I like the spiny lobster. They, they just weren't, they, they were just totally were cold. different than what we were Ooh, expecting. I'm full of them. <laughs> You do? Yep. I mean, too. It's hot. <clears throat> mm hmm. I'm telling y'all, I'm just saying, I'm trying to binge with bad bitch. <laughs> I'm trying to get a. God forbid I take a drink. What is that? What is what? that? Oh, okay, mom. <laughs> I'm like, what is that? Mmm. I'm stuffed. I can't even. I ain't got room for that. Did I do that? Hmm? Did I do that? You did that. Mm-hmm. I am full. <sighs> What's in there? Mom. 
Mm -hmm. Look, I'm like, what's in there, y'all? That's fat. Mm -mm. I'm so full right now. I don't even want to save that other leg, though, for crab salad. I want to eat with this. Mm, mm, mm. So, you guys, I don't want to take any more of your time with eating them. I'm stuffed. But I just wanted to tell you guys that I might come back in the near future, three, four months, and do something with y'all. Just to let you know that I am here with you and I haven't forgotten about anybody. I just, it's just terribly important that I make sure that I stay alive. So, um,. This would be the most appropriate time to tell them that I love you all. Mm -hmm. I'm so grateful for you all. Even for the ones that have come and gone. Because my subscriber count is up and down and up and down. I'm, as we've been talking about the last day. Like crazy. It's been up and down and up and down. But I'm alright with that. Everybody gonna like your content. Everybody gonna like what you do. So we just want to take a moment and explain to you why we're choosing what we're choosing. And so you understand that it's not that I don't. I'm always gonna watch you mukbangers. Like I, that was where I initially. That's where like, you started. Oh, I love it. So I love to watch them. Right. But um, I love to stay alive. So with that being said, it's late. We're tired. He has to get up for work in the morning, and I am just absolutely exhausted. So I will see you guys in the next video. You wanna take us out of here, Sam? <laughs> That's what I call you on videos. You take out of your Sorry, guys, our video cut. Take us out, Sam. <laughs> Please like, share, and subscribe to all of our videos. Hit the bell notification so that you don't miss any of our new videos. Amazing videos. Mm -hmm. We're gonna have some good. Oh, we got some good ones coming for you this week. Videos oh, coming. They're coming. Yes, so sir. Soon. Stay tuned. Yes. So. Have a good night, guys. I hope you had a blessed weekend, and we'll see you in the next video.